don't buy anything else, if you don't buy anything else on this freaking list, you need this product. And I don't know how well to tell you how important this is. Hi, I'm Yvonne. Thank you for joining me. If you are new, welcome to my channel. Today, I will be talking about my five I go five five um, must have natural hair products um, that have been super super helpful I know it's like this natural hair life is tough there's so 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 many products but what I do find is there are a lot of products but not a lot of them cater to 4c hair which is what I have I mean, if you don't know what 4C hair, there is a scale of hair in terms of it's it's characterized by um, I would say the curliness of the hair. So 4C is a tightest curl. Sometimes it's a curl. Sometimes it's a zigzag. So um, that's what I have. And when you have 4C hair, it's very hard for products to penetrate into your hair because the curls are so tight and they tighten each strand. So it makes it really hard for products to get in there. And these products that I'll be talking about today are I are <laughs> my favorite products that I have found. I've tried so many products, high end, low end. So these are the ones I've found really work well with my hair um, and that will work well with other hair types as well. So without further ado, I will get right into the video and I will be starting from my least must have all of these are must have but i will start from the my least to my greatest right so hope that makes sense i have five i'll count down from five to one and one is the one that you absolutely need there you go that's what i'm trying to say that's um so that's what i'll be doing so to start off the number five is this Jamaican um, black castor oil. This is from Tropical Isle Living and it's 100% natural, no salt, it says. Um, and I got this from Amazon and I love this oil. I think it's really good for, I usually add it on top of the, um, what's it called? I add it on top of my leave-in conditioner, which I'll also be talking about shortly. Um, and I don't put this on every day. That's why it's my number five. Not every day, but I don't put it on every time I do my hair. That's why it's my number five. Because um, you can use other oils, but I just love this one. But I highly, highly suggest it. And it has a lot of benefits. Also, is helpful with um, helping... I think it, it stimulates, I don't think, it's, so it helps stimulate your um, hair follicles, so it says. It doesn't say in this exact bottle, but when I did my research, so it's supposed to help with hair growth. Um, and it just feels good on my hair in general. I've done the coconut oil. That doesn't seem to do too much. Again, that doesn't penetrate into my hair. It kind of tends to stick at the top. So um, I find this, the castor oil, mixed in with the leave-in conditioner that I'm going to talk about shortly, does really well on my hair. So the next one on the list is my Cream of Nature Argan Oil. This is my edge control. This is the edge control that I found works the best. I've tried Hicks, but it always leaves white residue and I just don't care for that and some people have said it leaves a white residue because um, of other products so if it's by itself it's fine but if it's mixed with other products it's not okay that's not okay with me okay because <laughs> I'm gonna put my products to work well whenever I mix them with other things because that's what I'll be doing like as a forestry girl you don't just put one product and done no you need, to, you need a few products in your hair so I'm gonna need my edge control to work with whatever I put in my hair and that's why I love this cream of nature and argan oil because I feel like it lays my edges down because they're 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 hard to lay down okay so it lays them down and they stay down as long as I wrap it of course um, they stay down and it smells mm, it smells I'm not good with explaining smells I don't, I don't know what this I don't know what smell that is. I, I really don't know. But it is 
um, strong so if you're sensitive to smells maybe you may want to you know shy away from this but I just highly recommend it for my 4C girls and other of course hair types and I will go to the third one that you need and this is my absolute favorite moisturizer I've ever found that goes into my hair and it makes my hair so soft. I go through this stuff. Um, and this is my Shea Miracle Moisture Intense Leave-In Conditioner from African Pride. It's freaking amazing. I, I love this stuff. It is, it says it detangles your hair which it does it just goes into it penetrates me and i know i keep using that word but it's just the most fitting word for what i'm talking about today but it just penetrates into the hair strands and it just makes it so soft i love this um i don't use any other hair moisturizer other than this this is my absolute favorite I highly 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 recommend it and I just bought it on a whim one time I didn't even know it was a thing on YouTube I, I had no idea so I just kind of bought it one time when I was doing braids um, and I've loved it since I absolutely love this it's it's for sure a must-have highly 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 recommend I have searched high and low for conditioners okay because I co-wash all the time I don't necessarily always shampoo my hair but I co-wash all the time and I have tried Shea Moisture no shade on them but it just doesn't do it for me um, and I found that I've tried so many um, conditioners and who would have guessed it that Ozzy this mega moist conditioner quenches thirst locks in flash hydration this is the truth by far best conditioner I have ever used and the best part the freaking best part it's only two dollars and something cents at most three dollars from Walmart and they have it CVS it's everywhere um, but it's very very affordable and who would have guessed it's that affordable and it's really I'm telling you you need this conditioner if you don't use it you need this conditioner everything I'm mentioning you need uh, but this conditioner is I just love it it's my absolute favorite and now I've kind of started um, being super loyal to Aussie products and I've, tried, and I've tried their shampoo which I like as well but I didn't mention it because I'm talking about must-haves um, so yeah this Shea Moisture my fave so now to the number one must-have product and if you don't buy anything else if you don't buy anything else in this freaking list you need this product and I don't know how else to tell you how important this is I have tried this and I am on my third month trying this trust me trust me when I say this it works it works but now my number one product is biotin I know you're like what the hell kind of my theory is right you can use all these products I just mentioned my number from two to five Right? You can use all those products, but if you're not retaining length and your hair isn't growing, what's the point of using products, right? So that's where this biotin comes in. It helps with um, hair, skin, and nail support. And I found the most drastic difference. I can't say with my skin, but I have acne prone skin, so, you know, I, I do. This is what I have. But I can say for sure, without a doubt, my hair has started growing like crazy and I wish I had pictures to show you um, but I'll be documenting now moving forward because I just didn't know that how good these were I tried them my first month I was like oh shoot am I just tripping or is my hair growing hella fast and then the second month I'm like yeah 
no I'm not tripping my hair is going fast now the third month I'm like oh oh for sure oh for sure and this is the biotin gummies and as you can see I am I have how many I have like two or three more left I just ordered another bottle of gummies and I found that if you don't not, if you don't like vitamins like me I can't say I ever like <sighs> jumped on the vitamins wagon I can't say I really care to take them but when they're gummies and they taste super good these taste so good to me um, and they even say taste good on there um, and these are the extra strength so I'm not sure if that makes a difference but these are the extra strength and these are 5,000 mcg and I'm um, the natural the natural blueberry flavor and they are 100 gummies in here these 100 last year you, you take two a day whatever that is in math world I'll put that down here um, math was never my favorite subject in college so don't expect too much from me but these I want to say lasted two months I think I want to say two months um, it's just a hundred divided by two fifty anyways <laughs> um, yeah uh, these last a while and I just love biotin and there are other versions there's a pill version and then there's the liquid version and the reason I stuck to the gummies I would say is because again pills don't care to take them and the liquid version is more expensive even though people did say that it hits you faster it hits you faster it hits your body or your stream faster um, faster than the pills and the gummies because the pills have to go in and dissolve and so do the gummies so they always say make sure you chew the gummies all the way that's why people typically recommend a liquid version but I really don't care how fast you hit my system as long as you hit it and um, the gummies are my favorite again I just get excited to eat the gummies that's why I want to stick to it and these are $10 versus the $17 of the um, other ones liquid version so I'm trying to also save money and I feel like you go through the liquid one faster I could be wrong I'm not sure but yeah gummies these are a must so that is it for my five must-have products I hope you all enjoyed it um, I cut my hair like I mentioned not too long ago and these products have been essential essential in my natural hair journey and if you're not about this natural hair life and you're just kind of starting out I feel like I don't that's why I did five I don't want to overwhelm anybody with so many products and you don't need a lot of products these five are the only generally the only ones I use I may you know change them with the shampoo here and there but um, that's it you don't need a lot of products these are the ones that I use the most and highly 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 recommend and if you all have other products that you absolutely love and you think would work on 4c hair I specify because like I mentioned my hair takes a lot to work with so a lot of products may not work on my hair but if you have specific ones you know would work on my hair that work on your hair please comment below and let me know I'm always down to try new products I'm in love with what I have but I'm always down to experiment so if you have any that you suggest please put them in the comment section and make sure to subscribe and thumbs up while you're in that down there area anyway so please make sure you thumbs up if you enjoyed this video and if you are a fellow naturalista we are in this movement together it is hard out here people don't know people don't know how hard it is out here in this natural hair life but uh, thank you for joining me I'm Yvonne and I'm still polishing this gold and I hope you continue to do so too